What up YouTube, Topaz Yates back for another daily review and this one is to that Snoop Dogg, OT Genesis and Chris Brown at Thuya's company and I'm giving this one the red light. To be quite honest with you man, nothing about this project works all the way through man, like starting with that production where the production it got that west coast bounce that I tend to rather enjoy but yet the production just wasn't strong enough to carry it over as this is overtly a super west coast party like track right here man, where the hook not very memorable at all man, the basic concept with it being the partying and all of that man, they tried to spin it off into Thuya's company just talking about women and having sex and all of that but honestly it's just a bunch of individuals doing their own thing on a track that's just a party track with that kind of thing. And it's these kinds of songs that ultimately shows the fundamental flaws in Snoop Dogg and his whole skill set that he's had for quite some time. I mean Snoop is a legend, let's not deny that. Ever. Snoop did his thing for a very long time and people will only wish to be in the music industry as relevant as he's been for quite some time. But yet lyricism has never been his forte and it never will be his forte unless he goes out and seeks a ghostwriter you did. Because let's just look at his beginning balls that he had on here when he said that he got 25 ways to get it and 20 homies that's down with it and all he needs is 30 minutes. Like this really just comes off as somebody that wanted to go ahead and write a wordplay specifically around these numbers like there's a reason why he selected these numbers in particular and it was supposed to mean something but yet gave up halfway through because he recognized he didn't have the skill set to do it and this swagged the way through the rest of it. And that's rather annoying on these types of songs in particular that's more about showcasing your lyrical prowess because there's no core concept, there's no core story or anything going along with it is just you as individual spitting and if you don't have any skill set then why are you trying to do one of these kinds of songs is the ultimate question here. And honestly the only moment on this that I actually rather enjoyed was the OT Genesis verse where he says something that I didn't quite understand but the way he put it I completely got it like how he said that this chick is a flip threw her up in the air and she landed on the bros. Like I'd never heard that slang before but I completely get it now. That's just a chick that deals with a whole bunch of dudes most people will call those hoes. And the reason why I like that is because it's something that I've been saying for quite some time man. when I'm talking to individual rappers that need to grow on the fundamentals to build their skill set to be better rappers and such, I tell them you don't have to explain everything that you mean. You don't have to say everything painstakingly so people will understand it because if you say it cool, if you say it in a popular way, if you say it that people will rock with it, they will figure it out much like how I figured out exactly what a flip is just by hearing how he put it in a statement. And that's honestly the way that this life works when it comes to slang and all of that stuff. It spreads naturally because people hear people use it in statements and they say oh that's dope, I understand what it means, I'ma use it now and that's how it spreads and gets multiple meanings because people add on to it. Overall not a very good song right here man and it worries me because this upcoming Snoop project is an EP and if you base it on the rules I guess that we can go by which is uh, Joe Button saying that an EP is less than 40 minutes. We've already heard two songs off of this upcoming EP man and neither are all that good. Like. This EP may only be six to seven songs in total that Snoop is about to drop and this just shows you that it's not going to be very good already. But a quick recap here man, the pauses that I'm taking from this is nothing and the negatives that I'm taking from this is pretty much everything from this track you dig. I hope you enjoyed the show. You can follow me at Twitter up there and you can go to downloadpads.com that's down there to read today's article.